Hello friends, welcome to Action Script Video Tutorials series. From this video tutorial onwards, we are going to understand each and every concept of Action Script programming language with a lot of example programs. To understand Action Script, we take help of Adobe Flash. I have already installed Adobe Flash CS6 in my computer system. I suggest you people to install the Adobe Flash in your computer system so that you can follow up from here onwards. Once you install the Adobe Flash, you find a shortcut at the desktop. To launch the Adobe Flash IDE, double click on the shortcut available on the desktop. You can see that the Flash IDE got launched. This is the user interface of the Adobe Flash. At the top, we have menu bar. On the right hand side, some panels are open. At the bottom, some panels or windows are open. On the right hand side here, we have the toolbar. In the middle, we have the welcome screen. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss how to display a hello world text in the output panel. That is, we understand a hello world program in action script. We understand the essential code required to display the hello world in the output panel. Let's proceed and understand the steps. First of all, we need to create one folder which is going to hold all the resources related to our hello world application. I minimize the flash. I right click on the desktop, say new, click on the folder. I'm going to give here name hello world. This is going to be our hello world project. Okay. Then I go to flash. We are going to create one flash document. As we are going to learn Action Script 3.0 programming language in this video tutorial series, I tell to the Flash create a new Action Script 3.0 file. Adobe Flash is going to create one file which is going to have the title untitled-1. I'm going to save this file. I say file, save as, save the file in the hello world folder. We need to locate it. I say desktop. There we have the hello world folder. Open it. Then we give the file name. I give here the file name hello world, same as the folder name. This file is going to have the file extension .fla. FLA stands for flash application document or simply we say flash document. I click on save. I minimize the flash. You can see that in the hello world folder, Adobe flash has created one file with the name hello world with a file extension. I right click save properties the file extension is .fla and you can see see that the type is flash document it is a flash document file we can open this file at any time in the adobe flash i close this go back to flash next thing is we need to write the action script code and execute to write the action script code we take help of the timeline panel here in the timeline panel we have layer 1 in the layer 1 we have the first frame with a small circle displayed there. Can you see that? Click on the frame 1. Then go to window, click on actions or you can use the shortcut key F9. If you, if you click on actions, the actions panel will get visible. This actions panel is used to write the action script code. Here I am going to say trace. Trace is a function. A identifier followed by pair of parentheses indicates a function in action script to the trace function we can give a string here i say hello world i want to display hello world right sequence of characters enclosed in double quotations is called as a string in action script we are giving this hello world to the trace function trace function is responsible for displaying the given value in the output panel Every action script statement must end with a semicolon. So I write here semicolon. Then the action script code will not get executed automatically. We have to test the movie. This is actually considered as a movie. We can go to control menu, click on test movie, click on test or we can use the shortcut key control enter. If I click on test, you can see that in the output panel, we see the output hello world displayed and the flash has displayed this window. This is actually 
the stage this white stage this window is not at present useful much i discuss about this window later as and when we need so i just close this one so these are the simple steps that you follow to display a hello world in the output panel or this is a hello world program or essential code required to display the hello world in the output panel when we test the movie what actually the flash does means it creates one more file with the name hello world that is a file name same as the flash document file i right click on it save properties its extension is going to be .swf swf means shock wave file or small web format shock wave file or small web format okay this is a flash movie this flash movie you can double click and see it is something like an executable file if you double click you get that window okay i discuss about the importance of this window how it is useful later in upcoming video tutorials i hope you guys have clearly understood the steps to display the hello world in the output panel i close this window we can close any of the window by right clicking saying close right click say close and we can make them visible back by going to window menu click on timeline you can see that the timeline is visible go to window click on output or you can use the shortcut key f2 if i click on output the output window is visible now we go to window click on actions to display the actions panel to test the movie we can go to control say test movie click on test or we can simply say control enter to test the movie for this video tutorial this much is enough friends in upcoming video tutorials we understand the action script programming language concepts as well as we get the idea of design concepts we are going to understand how to create movie clips how to make animations how to control animations how to create games how to create simulations step by step so no worries at present i suggest you people to follow the steps and display some text on the output panel for this video tutorial this much is enough friends for more benefits and be up to date please subscribe to my youtube channel and don't forget to like comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited keep learning keep coding keep sharing thank you guys thank you very much see you in the next tutorial